Hi bros, if you don't like point finger throttle, then thanks to my Trotex adapter, you can have thumb throttle without any hardware modifying your is good. There is no need to cut any wires, you have just to tighten one screw. And you can have something like this. As you know, thumb throttle is much safer to use and this huge movement range, so you can much easier control the power and more precise compared to this thing. So all you need is this stuff. All links in the description. My adapter will fit on almost any Chinese e-scoot with standard 22mm steering bar, which should be kind of wide, like we've got in Lauti SR10, ES18, 19, TI30, Boyeda, Joyor, etc. It's super easy to install, you just have to have as much space as possible on the right side. So I will have to move this Echo Turbo switch to the left side. Inside this thing, as you can see, we've got wires, so if you would like to move the switch to the other side, you have to remove it, then move the switch and place it back, so it's like covering the wires. Now let's gently remove the brake lever, meaning computer with the screen and the button. On the right side at first, mini computer, then brake lever. On the left side, as you wish, I will stick to something like this. At first, echo turbo button, then lights, and at the end, of course, brake lever. Left side looks good. Trotex should be placed like this. So slide it on the string bar. As you can see, this guide got big hole at the middle. You have to slide inside point finger throttle. You have to use some force. Be careful, don't break this point finger throttle. The rubber will not break that easily, believe me. You have to slide it as far as possible. You have over here use lots of force. Okay, like this will be good enough. Now we have to set proper position of this adapter. We have to set Y axis and X axis. So, we have to move this inner part of this adapter with silver screw up as much as possible. This is good enough. So, this thing over here. Now, when we will hit full throttle, this red guide has to be at the middle of this part. So, I have to move it a little bit left. Can we hit more throttle? No, this is full throttle. So, like I said, it has to be somewhere at the middle like this. Now, raise the throttle and tighten the silver screw, but be gentle, this part is quite delicate. Not too much, good enough. When you will hit full throttle, as you can see, the throttle isn't going any further because this part with silver screw is blocking it, so even if you will try to smash it pretty hard, this point finger throttle in this mining computer will be not damaged. Also, if you would like to push it forward, then this guide is working like a spring, so it's pushing it forward, actually backward. And yeah, it's working super smooth. Check this one out. If you need more space for the grip, we can still move it to the left because we still got some gap. So let's do it like this. Yeah, it will be good enough. So again, let's push this part up. Let's add full throttle. This is full throttle now, and let's tighten the screw. Done. Also, what to mention is that this throttle got a little bit bigger movement range compared to point finger, so you can more precisely control the power. Can we damage it somehow? Now, I made it so it should work for quite a long time, but yeah, some testing are needed. Super precise, always the throttle is going back on the start position, so it's small chance that you, the throttle will stuck like this, it's even impossible. As a something extra, this throttle is almost working like your finger, so it's pushing this point finger into this direction like your finger will do, so there is really small chance that this adapter could damage the 
throttle in this mini computer. At the end we have to add this included washer which looks like this. One side is kind of raw. This road side has to be outside. So we have to install it like this and then place the grip. This washer is like safety washer because thanks to it you are sure that the grip will not block this throttle. So yeah, now it's pretty done. Literally first try on my Trotex adapter. It's working so smooth. And this rubber over here, it's it's super grippy. It's like your finger isn't slipping over it. I love it. So we've got turbo, dual drive and full throttle. All is good. And now delicately. Yeah, I can much easier, more precisely control the power. Because usually when I use this thing, it was more, uh, more torquey. But with this, I can much easier control the power. Let's smash it a couple times. It's working. Yeah, SR10 is not powerful like TI30, so I am not that worried to fit full throttle. And now we are going over those big potholes. I'm holding half throttle, and as you can see, my finger isn't going nowhere. Yeah, it's much safer to use thumb throttle. <laughs> yeah. Jeez, there's even more potholes. Swing arm is working great on SR10. I love it. Okay, but I'm testing my own stuff, so I have to be very critical over here. Like, I have to find this the even minor problems. So far is pretty decent bros. <laughs> it feels much safer to use this screw because I've got four front fingers on the steering bar. So it's much better. Over here we've got some MTB truck. Lots of roots. A certain is still working. She's good. Yeah, I can tell you right now, bros, that it's working great. It will be hard to find any cons because I designed it, so I thought about any cons which can appear. Even if you are like like to smash the throttle pretty hard, you will not damage this throttle so easily because I use this super hard to print filament which needs temperatures around 250 degrees I cannot tell you which filament is this but yeah so far I'm trying as you can see the brake kit I'm pushing this water pretty hard I don't recommend to do it be delicate with it because this is printed part but yeah this is how all those Chinese schools should be delivered with thumb throttle. It's when I reach the throttle, there is no any latency. It's working like stock point finger throttle. So yeah, goody good. Let's try do some woolly over this fallen tree. Yeah, easy. So much big roots as we even can hear. But yeah, thanks to this thumb throttle, I got all my fingers on the string bar. So now it's much safer to use this Chinese scoot. It's hard to do review about my own stuff. But if you are a customer of my eShop, then you know that my prints quality are at least decent. And also this design is not any worst. This is actually one of my best designs for this channel, for my eShop. I really recommend it. There is, for me, no cons. Everything is working super simple and so smooth. Yep, so far so good. If you would like to buy my Trotex, then you can find links in the description to my eShop. Actually, if you are one of my customers, then you know that my prints qualities and used materials are at least decent, like in this case. I'm pretty sure that it will work for quite a long time. 
so far no issues but yeah more testing is really needed i will also send a couple of them to my beta testers which will try to break it smash it but it can be quite hard to damage it at least this is my story but we will see so bros see you in next one